people normally bring up when you have presentations is the question on emissions, specifically now with all this uh, Volkswagen gate and uh, diesels are terrible and not environmentally friendly. But when you look at the marine side, it's, it's a quite the opposite, or the least environmentally friendly products you can actually buy on the market today is either a gasoline uh, lawnmower or a gasoline outboard. If you buy a brand new 2018 gasoline outboard, it's about the same emissions level as we had on cars back in the 1970s. When it comes to uh, diesel outboards, there is no emission regulation, so the diesel outboards uh, step into the same emission regulations as inboards and it's a much stricter control area. Well, the main characteristics that makes the OGC unique is that it's a diesel outboard. There are no other diesel outboards in the, uh, in the segment. Uh, Technology-wise, it's very different to all other outboards on the market. Uh, it looks like a regular outboard, it runs like a regular outboard, it fits the boat like a regular outboard, but underneath the shell, it's very different. It's a horizontal engine, it's got a much larger gearbox placed between the engine and the propeller shaft, and the uh, drive system between the engine and gearbox and the gearbox and the propeller shaft is a carbon fiber uh, belt system. Uh, in the Bison project, we have inherited a lot of the design features from the Oxy engine. Here in front of the engine, you can see one of the features. It's the air filter and the seawater filter and the fuel filter. Back here, you can see the, the seawater pump. And on the back of the engine, you have the oil filter, easy accessible. All the service points are easy accessible from the back of the boat. Maintenance is easy. We believe that if it's difficult to maintain, user may skip it and risk failure.